Here comes some forecasts, raising the inflation forecast, now predicting 2.1% in 2024. So rates unchanged, raising their baseline inflation projection up significantly. Off OECD yesterday, these are more optimistic numbers maybe than OECD. There's a lot grimmer tone. A, and then B, you're doing this in the middle of a war. They are expecting to move. They are expecting to monitor that inflation and have that be their primary concern at the same time that they remain flexible to issues that might be arising in other areas of the European region. That medium term forecast at 2%. That says that, uh, you know, the ECB has an inflation problem, but it's not as severe, I think, as, right. say, the United States or, is... or, or the UK. I think Europe's falling into a recession. It's got a tightening central bank now for the first time in a very long time. Um, but I don't think the US falls into a recession. I think China's probably going to be enormously stimulative in the second half of this year. Once you see some of that economic data, the earnings data start to roll over, we think that you're going to see a really, really challenging period for equity markets. I think you could see a bear market rally. And I'm going to say that it's a bear market rally rather than a full-on rally.